you got your cellular sizer, thank you for those who have stayed with us. I know that was a long session. Right now, we're going to do a 20 minute session and then Christine, who posts these, hi Christine. <laughs> um, we might be able to get her to, uh, to section this next part out so that we have reference to it in the program, but we also have it separate. So you don't have to go through a whole program and find out where this particular routine is. But again, this is, a, <clears throat> this is one that I created today on our Mr. Rebounder app. I call it the, the fat eradicator. And if you, re <laughs> I don't need to lose the weight. So I'm gonna be doing this with, um, <clears throat> and then eating a great big meal. But this one here, it's using the biggest muscles of the body. So we're gonna be doing a lot of the chamber run. But if you're just starting off, and you're not comfortable with that, or we get too many of the Jamba runs, that's okay. Just do the Jamba walk, go easy. It's still very effective. You've still got all your weight on the thighs and these muscles. And one of the things that we want to do is build up the circulation in the muscles so that, that we're able to do that. This kid right next to me is absolutely amazing. She's incredibly athletic and sorry, but I, it should just, she grew up on the solar sizer and she, she will probably make, smoke me on this, but, um, but, <laughs> but yeah, just go easy. Just go gentle and then, or just rock side to side. That's gentle too. I want you to have a good experience. If you feel like it's getting to be too much, listen to your body. Just gently, just go gentle. The purpose of this, however, is for those people who want a routine that's going to help them burn weight and increase metabolism. Diet has a lot to do with it. Toscarino just sent us over a beautiful little menu. And, and I want to talk, she has been a colleague of mine out in the health and fitness industry. And, and she is an expert on diets. She is an expert and, and she's agreed to send us some, some recipes. I'm going to talk a little bit more about her. I wasn't able to get what she sent me printed in time for this particular program, but we are going to put it online and a little information about Tosca online afterwards. But she's really been a godsend to a great many people. And she, like me, cares uh, about the people that she works with. And so I'm, I am very confident in, in recommending her, um, just like I... I've recommended Sally and Stephanie too because of the great work that they are doing. Just be careful at what you don't go beyond your comfort level to begin with. We want you to have a good experience. So, with that said, we're going to go through and 20 minutes. We'll be doing a baby health bounce for a minute, hip rock for a minute. The reason being, we do the baby bounce, warm up the tissue, get the circulation going. We do the hip rock. So we further um, work the circulation, and then we're gonna do power breathing. The power breathing is to increase oxygen into the bloodstream. We need oxygen to burn calories and utilize nutrients. So we wanna burn off that fill. We need to have, maintain good oxygen in the body. And it helps us avoid that lactic acid as well. We're gonna do Jamba Run for a minute. We'll do the health bounce in 45 seconds. When we're doing the health bounce, I want you to breathe. We want oxygen. The oxygen alone can increase metabolism. We want to get that oxygen into the cells so the body's going to work better. We're going to do another Jamba Run for a minute. Health bounce, 45 seconds. Jamba Run for a minute. Hip rock um, for 45 seconds. Now, the hip rock is simply helping increase that oxygen, making sure that we're pumping that oxygen to all these different areas of the body so it's going to be more effective. The cells, again, need oxygen to burn the calories. So we'll do another Jamba Run. We'll do power breathing for eight seconds. We'll do the baby health bounce for 30 seconds. Then we'll do the Jamba Run again for a minute. Then we'll do the twist for 45 seconds. You see what we're doing, we're graduating. We're helping to increase that oxygen, blood flow, and get access to any stored fuel. 
Original, initially, we're going to be eating up the glucose and the sugars that are in the bloodstream, the most readily available energy source in the body. After we've used those up and we continue to do the repetition, the body still has great demand for fuel. These muscles are the biggest engines, so we're going to be harnessing those engines for the purpose of burning that fuel. So then we'll do the hip rock and we'll do the jumbo run again. We'll do the baby health bounce for 30 seconds, a jumbo walk. So now in the jumbo walk, when our legs are feeling a little weaker, I want you to really kind of push down into the mat. You're going to be rocking a little bit and pushing um, down into that. You should feel that. Um, we'll do the baby health bounce and then we'll do the jumbo walk again. Again, we're pushing down. Then we're going to do the twist and then we're going to do the jumbo run for a minute. And then we're going to go from the jama run to a moderate spread. Okay, that is your legs. By the, be careful. <laughs> if you can't do that, just, just stay closer to the mat. Then we'll do the baby health bounce for a minute. That's the routine. You know why we're going to do it that way. And again, if you really want to burn a lot of fuel, once this 20-minute routine is done, do it again. You'll build up to it. But um, <clears throat> that's what... So Brooklyn was doing, and she has lost quite a bit of weight from that. Okay, that's not it. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on our mist, the, the monitor for the mystery about that because that we have a standalone monitor you can put on any mini trampoline, and when you, you press the button, up button on the standalone monitor, it comes on. It's got an intensity meter, it shows you the total amount of time, the number of bounces, and the calories burned. So anybody can use that. We also have for the Miss Rebounder app, we've got our wireless module. And the wireless module, for those who haven't seen it, is it just has a little clip. <clears throat> it's got a built-in oscillator. It actually measures deflection. It's not just a calorie. It can measure intensity. And that can measure of intensity on this, which in this has the same thing. We have a patent pending on it. Um, because it can measure the intensity, it can, has an algorithm that can tell you the number of calories you're actually burning. And so that will show you the number of calories burned as well. So I'm going to go, if you look at the uh, screen up there, I'm going to go to the home and go up to that little hamburger thing up there. I'm going to go to settings and you'll see it says connect Bluetooth device right up there at the bottom. So I'm going to hit that little button and when I hit that little button, Red light turns to green. I'm going to put it on the unit. You, know, you can just push the button while it's on the unit. You don't have to take it off. And then I'm going to hit connect. It's now connected. And I'm going to go back now to our workouts. Pick our workout. Everybody ready? All right, I'm going to try, um, drag that over. That's done. And I'm going to turn on some music. Okay, guys, can you see? Yeah. All right, so we're warming up. Okay, breathe. The whole purpose of this right here, <clears throat> warm up the tissue, open up the circulation. This is what I encourage athletes to do before they ever stretch or do um, some kind of an event, because it really gets to everything. Five, four, three, Okay, and then we're going to do the hip rock. So on the hip rock, if you lift those shoulders up and down, you're pumping the circulation in the lymph system. You're working all the internal organs in the uh, abdominal areas as well. So. If you're pushing down with the heel of your foot, 
a little bit into the map, you're helping to really elongate the spine and get some of that hip movement too. Okay, five. First jumbo run. Oh, the power breathing. Okay, jumbo run. You want to know how much you're working, just feel the top of your thigh. If they're not burning yet, they will be soon. And that burn becomes one of your best friends on the solar hydro because you know you're burning fuel when you do that. So depending on how much fuel you want to burn, it depends on how many times you want to do this. So you're pushing down into the mat Think of your heels pushing down. If you think of your heels pushing down, you'll stay more flat-footed and you'll keep your weight over your thighs. And if it's too easy for you guys, we'll go ahead and lift your feet up. So. All right. Breathe deep. We want to get oxygen. I sure like it when electronics work. Thank you, Brooklyn. All right, you ready? <clears throat> Jump around. So, Carrie, you feel anything yet? Oh, I didn't put your thumbs bar on for you. That's not good. We can switch. Yeah, you need a balance bar on this one to help. Yeah, I can switch it. <clears throat> I left that like that on purpose. I was going to show you how to put a push pin in if you needed to replace one and then put it on the unit. So, Terry, you keep going. I'm going to trade places with you and I'm going to just come on over here and keep working. Okay. So if you ever need a replace a push pin, that's how to do it. Sorry, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> Better? Yeah. Okay, you'll notice we've got the streamlined balance bars. We also have the half fold balance bar, which gives us a little more to hold on to. Okay, let's go at it again. I feel like I have to catch up to you. You can see that intensity meter on the app really go up. That little sidebar that measures the intensity, the calories burned, and the number of bounces, that, um, that's part of the wireless module option that you can add to the Mr. Rebounder app. We have that on our website too. What's neat about it is that if you're watching a television program, 
count, it'll ding in between each movement, but it'll count the number of bounces. So if you want to go beyond it, you say, hey, I want to reach 5,000 bounces. So you can keep going. Okay, hip rock. Breathe. I want to get that oxygen. The other reason we do this is when we do the jamba run, we pull a lot of blood and circulation right into the thighs. When we're done, the reason we're doing it as long as we are is so we can help pump some of that blood and that circulation back up to the heart so that we're getting this back and forth which is allowing the body to recover more effectively. I have a question. Answer. So if you go through like the drama run, all of it without taking like the breaks and the baby passes, is it less effective? Well, you can get sore more lactic acid build up because you really need to get oxygen and blood flow back to the thighs. Mm -hmm. So we do repetition so that we have time to get that circulation back to it. Okay. Because the body has to go and find more fuel. After a while, believe me, you begin to love it. It's like, wow, I love this feeling. It can become addicting. Get all the hormones you lose. Okay. Yeah. Agree. Baby bounce, we're getting that oxygen now. We're moving it. We want to lift our heels up and down. So we pump the calf muscle. The calf muscle helps to move that circulation from the lower extremities, making it easier on the heart. All right, jump around. Feeling it? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. I always try to get her to do things. <laughs> <laughs> so you're new to summer size. Yeah. Yeah, so you take it easy, be careful. You do this for a month, <laughs> the knees can get very, very strong. Running up and down stairs becomes easier. Or hiking, or any athletic event. Thank you, Bertie. Mm -hmm. She's very good at doing this too. Jump and run.
And if it's tough, remember, just a jumbo walk or the hip rock. Five. This one is the one that generates the most heat. This is aerobic. The whole thing's aerobic, but this is for intensity. Doing this with the app is so much better for me than trying to do it well. Okay, Jumbo Walk. You're pushing down. Try to stay in a seated position. Fence, 45 seconds. Kind of pumping with those calf muscles to feed that circulation to the thighs. Yeah, I can feel it. The calf. <laughs> Okay, we've done 3,000 bounces and jumbo walk. Can sit down a little further. Twenty seconds. Ten. 
10 seconds. Should be feeling good. And once you get to this point, if you've been able to keep up with it, you should feel more energy as if you, if you wanted to keep going, you could. Shall we run? seconds. After this one, we're going to do a moderate sprint. So if your legs are like jelly, just do the hip rock. <laughs> You did it! Okay. You want to burn a lot of calories. That is the way we know it burns a lot of calories. How do you feel? Yeah. Yeah. Good workout? Yeah. Yeah? Could you do it again? Yeah. Yeah, see? She probably could. How'd you do? Yes. Yeah? yeah? Yes. All right. We're helping to rebalance the body now. The soul homeostasis. Breathe deep. Start to relax. There you go. The fat eradicator, it is on our Mr. Rebound app. We burned 275 calories, so if we did that twice, we'd be burning 500 calories. We did 3,800 3, now <laughs> steps. So, um, good job, guys. And you've got, you've got a formula now. If that's what you want to do, if you really intensely want to go after it, That'll go after. Thank you. Um, let us know your comments, your thoughts. And I look forward to seeing you again in a couple weeks. Please write in what you'd like to have happen in, in a 30-day challenge. In the interim, for those of you who want, do this one for 30 days. And then let us know how the inches are working out for you. Thank you. Blessings. Stay safe. Stay healthy. 
See you in a couple of weeks.